Hello everybody, welcome to Me Paintings. I hope you are all healthy and safe. I'm Veronica and today I will be showing you a super simple acrylic swipe using loads of white color which I already prepared and then two swiping colors. There will be only a tiny bit of these colors. This one is violet and this one is Dalo blue and because lots of you asked me how exactly I mixed my colors I decided I'm going to show you today so I just open these and put a little bit like three tiny drops of this violet and also this Dalo blue these will be my swiping colors so I don't need to mix too much so just very small amount and these are great because I can these are quite heavy body acrylics so I don't have to use that much colors and then I mix my colors with pouring medium I make my own pouring medium from PVA glue and water so my PVA glue is from 60% of glue and 40% of water and now I put my pouring medium in my colors and I start mixing them so that's like 70% of pouring medium and 30% of colors and then I just mix them very very well you need to make sure your colors are mixed properly like this that should be all right the consistency is quite watery because it will be my swiping color so it's dripping like this not too thick and not too thin let's see the blue color so this is my blue color same consistency like my purple and now I will put two drops of silicone oil which I got online in Czech art shop I, th I think you can get loads of different brands in your local shops or art shops so that's two drops of silicone in each color then I will just mix it very gently not too much and it should create some beautiful cells I already mixed my white and my white is a little bit more thicker than my swiping colors so this is like 50% of white titanium white and 50% of pouring medium so now I'm gonna start by pouring my white on my old canvas which is not nice so I want to pour over my old canvas and I spread the white everywhere so now everything is covered with white and I'm gonna pour a little bit of white here again on the top and now time to pour my colors so I'm gonna pour this blue color here a little bit and then this violet here like that and now I've got this old piece of plastic I know lots of you asked me where I got it from I'm so sorry honestly I don't know where I got it from I think it was from some kind of art shop and it's just a simple piece of plastic not too thick not too thin and I'm gonna swipe with this piece of plastic just put it on and very gently go down like this Oop. 
Oh, that's very nice. That's what I hoped for. Now, I hoped for a little bigger cells, but it's okay. It looks... Look at this, that looks so cool. I think I'll embellish it somehow. But now I'm gonna get this dry. It looks very interesting. Hello, welcome back. So my pour is dry and I recently li listened to a song called Honeymoon by Carly and Martina and that inspired me to create this 3D doodle pattern which will represent two people who are madly in love and they just complement each other and then they blend into each other and they just complement each other so that's what it will um, symbolize firstly I need to draw little squares on my canvas which is size this is 20 times 25 centimeters so I'm gonna make lines here which will be five centimeters and then I will make square five times five centimeters. Now I will use my alcohol ink marker, it has got two tips, I will be using this smaller tip, I got this in local art shop, if you'll be looking for it just look for alcohol ink markers or any other markers. I will put a little dot in the middle of each square like this. And I start drawing.
Now I'm gonna shade some of these shapes and it will give you even more 3D effect. And I know this part is quite dark, it would be better if this was a little bit lighter, but I can't do anything about that. But if you'll be doing it, I recommend um, painting it or drawing it on a lighter board than the dark one. It's too dark, but I still like it. So now I'm just gonna take a little bit of black acrylic color. And I've got a tiny bit of water here, just a tiny bit of black with a little bit of water. I'm gonna start here. No different brush, which is dry. The other part. Yeah, and it added more depth into it. So now I will continue making more shades around these lines. It will give it a very unique look. And here's the result of my pour with 3D doodles. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it inspired you. Let me know what you think about this. And you can also join my Facebook group, Create With Me, and show me your beautiful art. Thank you very much for watching my videos. And see you soon. Bye.